Father Umbaka of Adoration Ministry. Don't come out. Don't come want to nibu. Don't come want the leaders. Where people a baby could have just watch this video. As you they watch, I bet say you share Ram. Listen to this video because that very important issue. Listen to Ram. Share this video. Like this video. I will see you on my next video. Watch Ram. Because of the horrible hardship in the country, because of the horrible mayhem, insecurity, poor governance. Inhumanity of man to man, indescribable immorality, and unquestionable disaster in the spirituality. Because of manifest unemployment. For example, during the election, those who want to become governors, presidents, and whatever, local government chairman, House of Assembly members. House of Rest members, those who want to go to the Senate, they will import guns and bullets. They will share to our young unemployed men and women to use these hazardous, toxic, destructive equipments to win elections for them. Of course, rigging. After the election, the so-called election saga. After the so-called election saga. They will not be able to return the guns back. They have empowered the youth with the guns. The election he said all these people thinking about creating jobs for these people they will leave them with their guns and banditry becomes the order of the day the same people who gave them guns we calling the young men hoodlums hoodlums bandits what else terrorists unknown gunmen kidnappers Armed robbers, as if to say they don't know them. Instead of giving them jobs, they gave them guns. When will Nigeria be okay? It is a sign of locking their destinies, locking the destinies of their youths. But I want to tell you, when God is involved, when the Holy Ghost is involved, how the emancipation will come, nobody will tell it. How the liberation will come. Nobody will understand it. How the freedom will come. It will dazzle everybody. It will be so astonishing. It will be so miraculous. It will be amazing. It may be so sporadic. It may be an activity that will happen like a lightning. Before you know it, it will happen like a thunder. Because it cannot continue like this. One day, a certain group of people will say, Never again Nigerians leaders who are thinking about how to go to Niger and help the, the, the democratic government to come back and blah 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 you don't know what you are saying you know your house is on fire and you are pursuing a rat Meanwhile, your family is inside the house and you saw a rat. You left the house that is burning and you are pursuing a rat. And those who set the house ablaze are coming with buckets of fuel. Save your house first. Heaven, let me tell you. Hello? Heaven is watching President Tinibu. Heaven is watching President Tinibu. If Tinibu submits to the power of God, God will use him to save this country. If he doesn't want to submit to the powers of heaven, something worse than what is happening in Niger will happen in Nigeria. I don't know how, I don't know when, I don't know. But on a prophetic code, I am telling them, let them not think that Nigerians are stupid, Nigerians are weak. 
Because we knew a time when one dollar is equal to one naira. What has happened? 